they call me I promise that you'll never be lonely Be the fan, that's what they call me I promise that you'll never be lonely What's good YouTube? It's your girl Indigo Back again with another video So I've been on TikTok lately doing videos that's why you have not seen me on youtube as much anymore my tiktok is cherry baby 23 underscore again it's cherry baby 23 underscore go check those videos out very entertaining so today we're just gonna do a simple makeup tutorial i'll be doing my mom's makeup and that's about it we will have before and after pics so let's get into the video hey and now you're all the time hands. not every cop is a bad cop not every black person is a bad person plain and simple and I have a lot of cops who are my friends I have cops who work for me they are incredible people we share it's one of my best friends that could share tons of stories like it, 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 it's amazing they're amazing people but they're always always in everything okay, what is this um, you know these situations especially they're people who make one entire profession one group of people look bad and as a black man uh, in this country country that's supposed to be free, a country that's supposed to have your back, supposed to be your country you work so hard for, and your family worked so hard for, my father, the military, all these years serving this country, but not have the freedoms that you're fighting for others to have. Not having the respect you're fighting for others to have, but expected to give respect is, um, is the hardest part. And you know, everyone I would probably imagine being being, being famous, being you know, known, does yes. it help? Yeah, in some ways. Oh, yeah, it does. Yeah. You know? Okay. Uh, yeah, but, but a lot of times, somebody doesn't know you're famous, we can ask to go out in the car, drive a nice car, just drive it. I get pulled over, cop pulled over <laughs> for nothing. I'm not speeding, I'm in traffic, oh, I'm nothing. Uh, just doing nothing but driving my way. Yeah. And comes up to my window, <laughs> looks in, and goes, Oh, okay. Michael, I'm such spot. a big fan. When I was a kid, I used to trick or treat him just to come by right <laughs> and And what a way to meet me. What is by it? pulling me over for doing nothing. That candy glow shit. That's not the first time. Many, 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 many times in my know, years. Okay, but it's just little it's things like that. Just agitate. <laughs> but imagine if. Are you if, hurting him? You're not. Who's that? Imagine if it happened to you all the time. Imagine if you're you're getting pushed around and disrespected and talked to in a way that makes you feel subhuman. How good? How good you I and that to see that was her. George Can Floyd die the way he died. You get such a callous attitude towards his life. Just begging you to let that man breathe. It angers me. Angers me. I get the protests. I understand the protests. I do not agree with the looting and the rioting. Hey, you, what is this? You can have That's this taking advantage of the situation. This honor <laughs> and all the others who we know of who have died senselessly at the hands of the police. Make sure you get in my um, friends. You know, I, I, I'm, I'm shocked and surprised right we gotta keep right having here. this conversation over and over and again. I got these over and over again. Yeah, every, every, every few months, every year, whatever, feel like we're having these conversations over and over again. And have what to makes stop. My lips too? Because <laughs> people are human. James, like, we oh. need to be <laughs> each other and they're human beings. <laughs> and treat your fan, expect them to get And you came over that fence, like, you do this shit every you day. You have to worry. Somebody get these people on the hurdle, 100 meter hurdles. <laughs> Track and field. Don't let them go mad. Listen, let me run your eyes. Shit, man. Shit, man. So, am I in my pit? Absolutely. But. Okay, well, I'm talking for me. If I show too much anger, then they scare of me. I just gave it to you over there. It's in the compound pack. This I put it back. I, 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 I took out. Yes. I, I hold on. Let me see. Hope my kids can grow up and be in a place that's better than the place that, that we're in right now. What's wrong with this bronzer? That's the only thing we can hope for. And if it doesn't change now, I don't know what's going to take to change now. Because now the power is not in the politicians. Okay, let me see. The power is not in some of the Let me see. Hold on. Hold on. The power is in people. Okay, she said this is not a good color. We all know that. I mean, it is. So we need to stop depending, I feel, on others to change for us. We gotta get together, we gotta make a change for ourselves. In a positive way, in a peaceful way. You got a bronzer for me? Um, 
continue to have these conversations. I think it's important. Uh, a lot of people continue to respect each other. I don't have all of it. And most of all, can you add a light of this? You got a light of this? I hope you do it. Oh, okay. Well, I hope you have a bronze in my color. Is is this your color? I got a bronze in your color. I just asked, is this your color? Oh, my God. And do you have one for me? I don't know. I got to look at it. Okay, well, okay. okay come on. No, I just want my own bronzer, and you, you can use your bronzer. No one said you couldn't. Stop trying to break my ankle. Try to break this thing. It's melted. President Trump sparked outrage and criticism this week when he made his break to the White House property and closed down. So I like my makeup to come from the Bible. After the Bible, cleared of mostly these were protesters after the president spoke. It's a bee powder. They don't even say, what is, what is it? It's a bronzer, but it's not my color. Oh, okay. It ain't got the undertone. It's got like an ash undertone. Dr. Ben, Secretary Carson, um, thanks so much for joining us. I'll be seeing bitches on YouTube makeup tutorials. This shit take 30 minutes. Uh, they put like 17 motherfucking uh, layers of shit on it. Uh, uh, make sure you do my eyebrows right. I put my eyebrows shit over there. You see it? Because she was like, hey, put it back. For seven weeks. Well, I don't even put this much on me. Well, I don't know. Because we got a lot in here. I don't know. 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 I Okay, you need something lighter than me? I got it right here. Oh. Uh, the way that he wants to conduct himself, but uh, I generally don't find it particularly useful. Oh, this is Donald Trump. Ah! I swear to God! God. What? You're fucking punching my eyeballs! Protesting almost entirely No, not that shit. What's been your reaction to this motherfucker? I thought she was kneading dough. And to the protests we've seen in this week. Well, I think like just about everyone else, I was horrified to uh, see the videos of that blatant. Uh, I was almost horrified to see the other officers just standing there and uh, not stopping this. Uh, as far as the protests are concerned, yeah, let Roman be over there with his ass. Roman can handle eight. He can handle his ass. That's one of the killers. <laughs> 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 and we should always hey, uh, protect that. Don't be uh, rough, Roman. I'm going to beat your ass. And I said be over there with him and teach him the tricks. I didn't say for some more abuse. I think he's going to be in one spot and play tag. Uh, those look, are the look, things look, look, tie Leo not tying yourself out. And you know, <laughs> as yeah, far as game. the Black Lives okay. Matter is concerned, uh, I hope How that they don't get a little of Okay, yeah. brush them up first. You know, you got to brush them. Yeah. Yeah. Do anything you yeah. 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 concerned yeah. about them yeah. as we are yeah. about yeah. anybody yeah. else. And until we begin to that kind of concern, I don't Stop think we have I want to make them look like really? like up here like this <laughs> week like, 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 can you make it look a little on both sides according mm -hmm. to you now don't use every opportunity to criticize a brawler to try to make them look like you yeah. 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 insults at each other that's not how you talk about how you don't like to demonize people uh, three days after you said that though the president retweeted a video clip he's stirring the uh, shit out of that jamie uh, personality get that from him about george ace that, that shit is watery like a motherfucker <laughs> one of them said quote that is skim milk now <laughs> won't you are you gonna drink it george floyd was not a good person you gonna drink it i know that you didn't drink it but the president did. go drink it in the kitchen now i'm on the market <laughs> What will help you know, you're supposed to use that part. If we will oh, I'll be using the end. Uh, Let's not make uh, okay, the solution okay. be a Democrat solution or a Republican solution. Let's make oh, it a solution and recognize that our country is... Well, to have, this is the best solution for other people. People from caravans trying to get in here and other places they're trying to get out of. There's a reason for that, and we need to make sure that we preserve that. No one can Let me see. Let's have a look. Not China, not Russia, not Iran, 
No one can, but we can destroy ourselves. You got to uh, no, you got to get uh, a well, Why are you trying to set some up now? No, no you we set up your ass. Oh, right. So must be smart enough to recognize. And you know what I need? Not a lot of I need primer. You be using primer hole? No, you got to put this in. That's what makes the last this You're you're calling for feeling your you got primary You don't got primary President Trump. But primary is important. What's one you like? The mist or the I had two face. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. 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 That's what I'm the cheapest shit at the makeup store be like $11. Yeah, it's it's get <laughs> no, you just forgot. You, so you, so you can edit it. Editing queen. There you go. Girl, it wasn't even on her face. No, it wasn't. I just helped you. Girl, that's what was going to set her head like this. She must have moved then. We had said it right. Oh, what? I've been sitting here. <laughs> is a problem in law enforcement agencies in the United States. We say, I said Let's say we this. I grew up in a time when there was real systemic racism. I Don't forget to put my tail on, Andy. Student. I was the only black student. I got the highest academic achievement. And well, well, I got up and berated the other students. They weren't trying hard enough. Because of black kids, and, and, and that kind of oh, thing yeah, was not just, uncommon when I was growing so up. That kind of thing Bonnie. is very uncommon now. Yeah, are there still racists around? Absolutely. Yeah. Uh, there were yeah. yesterday. There are today. Okay. There will be tomorrow. You know. But that doesn't mean that we shouldn't oh, fight it. And this is an opportune you time know. right now. People are concentrating. Just don't make me look like a giant. moment slip away. <laughs> You know, yeah, we yeah, need to deal with yeah, some of the issues. Uh, and the <laughs> I don't want to look camp. Uh, Let me say that. I don't want to look camp. Yeah, That's more me. <laughs> They're very you know, much damn dead right now. The vast majority of policemen are camp. There's camp, camp glam, glam, right, and I don't want to look like camp. <laughs> <laughs> That's where I'm correcting myself, uh, people. Like, like, what's that like, glam? Uh, they can be wearing body cameras. There are things that right. can be done. I don't want to offend anyone. I look everyone. You chose so much so. about this, and now is the time to do it. Everybody's that racist. Let's not let this but moment slip away. At the same time, we must or be anyone very, who's a racist. Uh, vigilant about these groups they can of eat a anarchists dick. who destroy the livelihood to the very people like that they claim to be trying to help. Don't edit that Let's out. Not be Let's not be seduced <laughs> into accepting silly things that make absolutely no sense because we want to honor somebody. But let's just make sure that we think this thing through. Think about the consequences. You want to abolish the police department? Are you kidding me? What happens if you do that? Everybody goes out and give, give them that rope. They start a hiring vigilante groups to protect If he said he's trying to bite you, then get out of there. That makes absolutely no sense. The, uh, the kind of talked a lot about this week about the, the proper way to protest. You talked about it too. Um, the NFL admitted on Friday that they quote were wrong for not listening to NFL players earlier and encouraged all to speak out and peacefully protest unquote. But take a listen to what President Trump had to say about NFL uh, players peacefully protesting. This is at a 2017 rally in Don't take the bone from what we gonna do. When somebody disrespects her. Like, here, no, stop. <laughs> like, Piggy, you hear me talking to you, nigga? Answer me. Say, say another goddamn motherfucking word. Still opposes those who protest police brutality by uh, during the national anthem. You said no. That's a It's a water buffalo bone. Whether emptying the streets of Times Square, wrecking state-of-the-art sports cars for fun, or blowing up real military ships, the movies on this list have invested heavily in solitary scenes. 
Lasting mere minutes, these sequences are the most expensive movie scenes ever filmed. Vanilla Sky sets the tone of surreal, reality-questioning confusion from the opening scene. The perfectly groomed, gray hair plucking playboy millionaire David Ames wakes as Radiohead's everything in its right place aptly lyricizes his life. At only 30 seconds of screen time, the scene provides a fundamental function Tay. in the narrative, questioning the nature of reality. You saw all of them uh, rice crisps? Surprisingly, no CGI was used. Instead, director... Man, I need one. one. I need one. How many left? Uh, no, I just asked him if there's only one left, damn. Is it? I want the rice crispy trick. Is that what this fucking dog was? Absolutely. How much is it, Tay? Cruz's enigmatic star power with the desolate backdrop. Damn, the white host the whole said they was $5 a piece. That's, the That's what Indy said, you said. No, I said I might do it with $5 a piece. They helped with doing it, you know, she was like, Because they have people on their butt. Don't do them. They lay people out. I'm not going to wait. Let me go oh, go get my body well, down so so How much is the Oreo? Yeah. In a race against time, Neville's family then comes a it breathtaking moment of tragedy. The military cups. bombs the building bridge. Eat my cups. Amidst the chaos, the blazing bridge collapses Wait, into what? the water below, and Neville's family crashes and dies. That was not it. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. This is one person? Was used to yeah. the Let me see. Yeah. Yeah. To help fill the surrounding evacuation. Oh, I got the tea ready then. That was my idea, and I feel like it was Wait, is this as a It's just as a post? But he can't eat this. Do you eat this? Yeah, I mean, how can get him a piece of my rice? The green light on the project and yeah, that the cost a clear five. Wait, so your vote is seven a piece? Damn, Damn I want one of these motherfuckers. I mean, I can go in my jar and get you some. So it's ten dollars. The answer is yeah, probably yeah. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I can get the other one. Do you want more milk? Preston Martin TV five for two. Do you want more milk? Y'all might be old. Bad and fast and split down. Okay. Right, I got four dollars. I got five dollars. I got that on. <laughs> but he can't eat that. Rice Peter shit. I mean, he can't eat that. 2015 film. Jamie, that shit is cold as fuck. Millions Hollywood has to play with. Thirty-two million dollars. Three hundred million to three hundred million dollars. Budget was spent on cars. Jamie, Jamie, you're going to work. I got money. I need Jamie. We got a meeting. With who? Chris Brown. Before my bed, when I woke up, probably watching my dog and I for eight to nine minutes, then fled down the hallway and caught a black mass materializing by the door and so moving thirsty. towards my bedroom. And then in the yeah, lower right hand side of the video, you can see it leaving, resulting in me and my dog visibly shaking. <laughs> The clip does indeed appear to show a shadow figure seeming to materialize on the wall. Whether it's demonic or not is debatable. It doesn't appear to cause any evil although, perhaps the feeling of it was insidious. The man's dog certainly looks scared enough. What do you think this shadow bean wants? Could it just be a friendly ghost? Number 11, emergency. If you've ever been in an abandoned building under a state of emergency, you know how alone this man feels. With just over 28,300 views, this video titled emergency.mp4 was published in March of 2016 by YouTuber Paul Cyrek. This description reads, I was at hospital and woke up. Everyone left, but I found one still there after camera battery died. The hospital in the video does indeed look abandoned, making the emergency sound and maybe flashing lights all the more terrifying. 
For some reason, with no one else fleeing the scene alongside you, fears heightened, heavy breathing and heavy sighs are heard through the camera. The cameraman passes through the hospital, down a hallway, through a door around a corner, and another door and hallway. No one is there, leading us to wonder who exactly this man found after the camera battery died. David Roman says he used to work hospital security and that he thinks this is a security guard during a fire drill and he suggests that patients weren't evacuated for the drill. Rather, it's more likely this was a closed off wing under construction, which might explain the pallets and construction equipment spotted in the video. Something that wouldn't be found in patient areas seems like a valid explanation. However, it's still terrifying to think about. Number 10, haunted closet. Closets are usually harmless, but a series posted by Radlad1 has us wondering what's on the other side of that door. According to the uploader, the closet in question hasn't been altered since he moved in, but creepy occurrences keep happening with it. In the first video, he opens the door to the small closet, which has a disused TV on the ground, several hangers, and some random stuff on the shelf, including a stuffed animal. The next video is where the creepiness comes in. You can hear the door rattling slightly, and as the dude gets closer to it to examine what's going on, why would you come right this way? It's on its own, and jerks open before jerking shut. The spookiness continues with the next video, in which the man says he hears constant sounds coming from the closet. He approaches it again, and as he reaches towards the handle, a terrifying rattling is heard, causing him to jump it back away again. The last video culminates in probably the scariest happening. There is a knocking on the door and a rattling. It's her plainest day. When the guy opens the door, you can see there's nothing at all inside. I think we're all thinking the same thing. It's water. time to move. <laughs> Number nine, yeah, Paranormal in Lodge Investigation. Some haunted places hide uh, secrets only the afterlife knows. Yeah, this video is a that private man, investigation of, of the Tumbaqua Alex Lodge, which occurred on Saturday, September 14th, 2019. <laughs> Apparently, the Alex Lodge in the town of Tumbaqua, Pennsylvania, has some haunted history. Uh, it's in a converted apartment building. No, there are claims that the Elks Lodge is haunted by the ghosts of I two people who took their own lives and resided in the previous apartments. Wow. Some yeah. claim they've heard voices and seen poltergeist activity. When the Pocono Paranormal team investigated, <laughs> they caught numerous yeah, orbs in a voice that said, love you. So what did Team SERT find? Oh, they too captured orb and light anomalies on the scene, as well as <laughs> where the hand came from after six years. Originally posted in July of 2014, the German private investigator is seen with his crew in a darkened room. They're all facing one way in what appears to be a hallway, likely getting ready to enter another room in the space they're investigating. Pretty normal, that is, until a hand appears out of the bottom left side of the screen, as though to pat one of the crew on the back. It flits on screen for a moment, while the crew remains unaware, before disappearing again in an instant. In the comments, Redditor RWP80 says that it looks human but with a finger missing. Another says it looks like an animal hand, maybe that of a raccoon, but it doesn't seem animal at all to me. It looks indeed human. Who was in the room that night with these investigators? And what did they Don't want? The, um, Only the disembodied hand knows. Number four. Phantom Menace. Have you ever seen a ghost video that looks 100% authentic? Posted by YouTuber Faden. This short clip will have you questioning everything. The video shows some ghost investigators entering a darkened room, searching out with two flashlight beams. One tells the other to cover his back while welding the camera. The sights.
girlfriend, that's what they call me. I promise that you'll never be lonely.